thank you very much, voice of God, whoever that was. I'm delighted uh, to have these few moments to introduce uh, for you a video message from our great friends at the Universidad Francisco Marroquin. But first I have to say how delighted I am that the, uh, the great voice got my new title correct. In the six weeks since I've assumed the role of President Emeritus, I've come to appreciate how few people seem to have heard that word before from the Latin emeritus. And I have been introduced at least on two occasions as President Emeritus. <laughs> and I, I quickly respond by saying, no, I take medication for that. <laughs> but just think of me as the uh, guy who's sort of semi-retired and uh, after 50 years of wearing a tie every day gets to take it off a little more often. Uh, but before I say a word about uh, the cherished relationship between Fee and Universidad Francisco Marroquin, uh, I have to say, if you haven't yet stopped by UFM's booth, please do so. I was blown away when I saw the use to which these postcards, seven or eight of them with various great lovers of liberty from UFM's founder, Manuel Ayao, to Ayn Rand, to Leonard Reed, to Henry Hazlitt, several others, uh, the use to which the uh, folks at the Video Game Center at UFM have put these interesting postcards. I just want to say that you need to stop at their booth. Uh, the Video Game Center at UFM has created, and this is a part of it, an augmented reality trivia app to test your knowledge of famous lovers of liberty. You have to download the free app, which is UFM Mentors, and stop by the booth to collect all of the mentor's cards. You'll be amazed at what that app will allow you to do. These faces come alive uh, with the use of that app. And the winners of uh, uh, each challenge that you'll see when you get the app will receive a bag of prizes tomorrow at 12.50 p.m. at UFM's booth. Have fun playing that fantastic game. Well, I'm honored to introduce a short video uh, to you that recognizes easily the most uh, long-standing and cherished relationship that Fee has had and continues to have with a partner organization. We have many partners in many parts of the world, dozens of them uh, on almost every continent, but our relationship with UFM goes way back to the beginning of that ins institution, which is now approaching its 50th anniversary. Leonard Reed, the founder of, of Afi, and Manuel, or Musso, as he was known to his friends, Ayao, the founder of UFM, had a long friendship. I knew both men personally, served on the board of Afi in the 1990s with Musso, uh, and I knew Leonard in the last seven years of his life. And I can tell you, others who knew them both would tell you the same, that they were so much alike in so many ways. They were passionate, they were gentle, they were dedicated, determined, fired up for liberty, and a class act, both of them, in every way from start to finish. Our relationship with UFM has been so important to us in uh, these nearly 50 years, and it has manifested itself in a great many ways. We have had every year uh, at fee seminars students who come all the way from Guatemala. We have uh, more than two dozen students and other uh, officials from UFM at FECON here this year. Few other places in the world send as many uh, of their students to our uh, programs as does UFM. We've had events at UFM, and uh, that partnership continues to grow. Recently, we announced the launch of FI en Español, directed by my fee colleague, Javi Perez. Javi, are you here tonight? I want everybody to know where you are. Raise your hand, wherever you are. Okay. Javi is doing a fantastic job in this new uh, outreach venture for us. In so many ways, our roots are deep in Latin America, but this is the first time we will have had a coordinated uh, a program directed at Spanish-speaking countries in Latin America run by a full-time professional on our staff. 
This will give us the opportunities uh, to work even more closely with UFM and uh, similar organizations throughout uh, the hemisphere in the years to come. Uh, finally, I just want to say that uh, uh, my friendship with Musso was very special. I remember uh, so many board meetings uh, with him, with his glasses, always with the, uh, what do you call that thing, you know, you hang it around your neck. I stick mine in my pocket, but he always carried his, his around his neck. And uh, uh, he had the quality of uh, immediately engendering the attention and respect of people who met him. You knew from the moment you shook his hand that this was a man of consequence and of courage and of conviction. He was every bit that uh, from start to finish. So here, uh, I'm happy to introduce to you a video message from our friends at Universidad Francisco Marroquin in Guatemala to Fee and to all of you. <laughs> 